During these unprecedented times, we have stood with Black Lives Matter, watched power resurge within our communities, all while battling COVID-19, which continues to have a disproportionate effect on Indian country. We hope that you'll find hope and resilience within these videos made by some of our program's alumni. Good morning, Indian country. My name is Christopher Natani Sigelski, and I'm a member of the Navajo Nation. I am originally from Flagstaff, Arizona, but I've been writing out this COVID experience out here in LA. As we know, these times have been very isolating. And for me, this is a time where I can become really depressed and a lot of my fears and anxieties can really build. It's tough not being able to see my family back at home and it's tough to see what you know, the pandemic has been doing to not only the Navajo Nation, but our native communities all across the country. In these times, I really look for sources of inspiration. And a huge source of inspiration for me these past few years has been the organization Wings of America. Uh, lucky for me, I, my cousin is an executive director of Wings of America, and I was able to catch up with him the other day, and he gave me a great piece of advice. Even with dozens of mutual aid efforts working around the clock to provide for our elders and most vulnerable community members, it's still terrifying to think of the long-term effects this pandemic will have on our communities. So now, more than ever, for your spiritual, mental, and physical health, it's important to get out and move, to take care of yourself for those who need us for a long time, but also to help take care of the land, to take inventory of the blessings that we've been given, and make sure that they stay there for generations to come. Normally, Wings would have teams of high school and college-age mentors from across Indian country out there teaching the younger generation about proper warm-up and cool-down technique for running in any sports, about Native American running history, uh, about nutrition and diet. This virus has made gathering those groups impossible and too dangerous. So we're trying to transmit as much of that information and knowledge as we can digitally through videos. Dustin and Wings of America were able to remind me that we can still use running not only to stay connected to our communities, but to also stay connected to our ancestors and the land. I know their message has definitely inspired me to stay more active and to go out there on my own and run. I hope it's able to do the same for you. Hey Indian country. Hey Indian country. Hey Indian country. Don't let this virus keep us down. Move with the strength of our ancestors. Pass on the message of resilience. Take flight. Take flight. Take flight. Take flight. Take flight. Take flight.